My next guest is a comedian who can be seen live at Comedy Works in Denver, Colorado, November 2nd through the 4th. Please welcome the very funny Sean O'Connor. Hey, everybody. How are you guys doing tonight? Nice to meet you. I am Sean O'Connor. This is my energy. Let's get used to it. All right, good. I was a really smart kid growing up. I don't know if any of you guys are smart, but I was. Uh, here's how I know I was smart. I quit karate as a child, so I wouldn't have a ponytail as an adult. <laughs> now you guys know that I'm very smart. I have ADD. I don't know if any of you guys have, but if you don't get it, it is the best. Uh, <laughs> My doctor prescribed me Adderall. He was like, you can't drink on Adderall. I was like, no, you totally can. It makes it better. <laughs> I'm like, you should know that. You're a doctor. <laughs> Why are you lying? <laughs> I love Adderall because not only does it help you concentrate, but it's also an appetite suppressant. So most of the time I'm like, I could eat dinner right now, or I could read 10 books about birds. I read 10 books about birds. <laughs> Guys, I know so much about birds. <laughs> Did you guys know a bird is the only animal you can throw and you're helping it? <laughs> you throw a dog, you're a monster. <laughs> you throw a bird, you're gonna hear the word majestic. <laughs> and what's better than that? I don't understand people get super muscular, like super muscular ripped and jacked in their muscle areas, and they're not professional athletes. Like, my little brother's super muscular, ripped, and jacked, and he says things like, image is everything. And I'm like, yeah, look at you. You're like a really strong restaurant manager. <laughs> Must be able to lift so many plates of shrimp. Uh, it's useless. I took a screenwriting class in college that was taught by the guy who wrote Mannequin 2 on the move. That happened. That guy would give me notes on everything I wrote. He'd be like, this needs more character development. And I'd be like, should I make her a mannequin? Because that's what you did twice. Talk about something serious. I got, I got arrested in high school, which is the best time to get arrested because it doesn't count. And what happened was I was at a party and I was drinking a lot. And I was like, you know what I'll do? I'll go smoke pot. And guys, do not go down that road. <laughs> what happened was I went outside of my friend's house, started smoking pot, and in the suburbs, they have these things called cops. And... <laughs> <laughs> They're not always a fun bunch. And so the cop got out of his car, and he said, are you smoking pot? and I'll never forget what I said. I said no, and I sprinted as fast as I could. <laughs> he was way faster. He caught me, arrested me. I went to a Catholic high school. Guess what, guys? They hate when their students get arrested. <laughs> they tell my parents, they're like, we're going to expel your son unless you send him to drug counseling of your choosing. So that summer, my parents sent me to a summer camp for magicians. <laughs> and I'm here to say, guys, it did not work. <laughs> it just made me way more creative with how I hid my drugs. <laughs> Because now I can never get arrested because they'd be like, oh, you mean this cocaine officer? <laughs> it's doves. <laughs> and fly away. <laughs> I told that joke one time and there was this guy sitting in the second row. When I hit the punchline, he turned to his friends, gave him a high five, and screamed, I'm going to try that. <laughs> I thought it was so awesome that this guy would throw away what was obviously like years of his drug dealing technique to incorporate my joke into it. Every day now, I read the newspaper to see if he got arrested <laughs> for being like, oh, you mean this cocaine officer? 
And then cocaine would just go everywhere. <laughs> He's like, oh, right, I forgot to buy the doves. <laughs> I am so stupid. Thank you, guys. I'm Sean O'Connor. That's great. Thank you.